Hi everyone and welcome to Wizardry Workshop. Today we're going to be making balloon ornaments in Hogwarts house colors like the ones you see here. To get started with this project we need a bowl, water, glue that dries clear like this one or craft glue or school glue, and a foam brush. First we're going to pour some glue into our bowl. And then add just a little water to dilute it some and make it easier to apply to our string. Now using the foam brush, stir until the glue and water are well mixed. We're ready for our string and balloon now. What I'll be using is some size 10 crochet thread like these. You could also use yarn, cotton twine, embroidery floss, really whatever you have. You want to blow up your balloon to about the size of your fist or a little smaller. You can use regular balloon, but water balloon size works great. Now to get started, we want to take our string and tie it in a knot around the end of the balloon. Then take a dab of the glue and tack down the end of your string. Now we can begin wrapping the string around the balloon. I'm going to wrap in one direction all the way around the balloon. Then I'll change directions and start wrapping the other way to cross over. Keep wrapping and changing directions until you get good string coverage on your balloon. Once covered, snip the string and tuck the loose end under other wrap strings. Now using the foam brush, we're going to apply the glue all over the wrap balloon. Make sure all the string is covered and you're using enough glue to saturate the string. After it's all covered in glue, you can take a small cup and use that to hold the balloon while drying. It is going to take a long while for the glue to dry, overnight or longer probably. Check it after a few hours to see if the top is dry, and if so, flip it over so the underside has a chance to dry out. I set mine in a warm location overnight and that worked out well. Before moving to the next step, make sure the string is dry in all areas of the balloon. Once dry, we'll now pop the balloon. I'm going to do this by taking the scissors and cutting off the end of my balloon. Removing the balloon may be tricky if you don't leave a big enough gap to grab it. I'm going to take this Cricut scraper tool to pull mine out, but you can use tweezers or a crochet hook too. If you manage to not cut all the way through the balloon end, you can also use what's still attached to pull the rest out. The last one of these I tried making was with black and all the house colors mixed in, so you can experiment with multiple thread colors on the same balloon and see what you come up with. 
Now I'm going to take some of my green string and use it to make loops so I can hang my ornaments. I'll just loop this piece of thread through and knot it to finish. And now we can hang them up.